Hi everyone, Chef Anthony here at Dawn's Appliances. Today I'm answering the question, is sous vide the best way to meal prep? Think about families on the go, things of that sort. So sous vide is a great alternative to really bulk up your meal prep, super easy, nice and clean, and you know what, you don't have to worry about it. So first and foremost, what is sous vide? So sous vide is, uh, you know, cryovac packages, whether it be proteins, vegetables, and starches, and it infuses the flavor. So you put it in an immersion bath at a controlled time and temperature, the water circulates around and really cooks your food precisely every time. The best part about it in the chef's hidden secret of sous vide is you can pack a lot of flavors in it. Once you cryovac it out, you're taking the air out of it. But look in like this chicken, for example. We have lemons, we have scallions, we have onions, we have seasoning, things like that cryovac in. Now the circulation of that water and the immersion of it will really help tenderize it, add that flavor to it as well. So probably took me, let's say about 40 to 45 minutes to prep these all, bag them and seal them. But I have, you know, two packs of chicken, I have center cut steaks, I have herb roasted potatoes, I have broccoli, I have cauliflower, I have asparagus. So the possibilities are endless. And the best part about it is, you know, I could take this package, this package, and this package, and this is a full meal that I could put in the immersion circulator and really cook it and then sear it for dinner. Or if I wanted to, I could freeze this, put it in my refrigerator for later on in the week and really just grab and go. And I know everything's done. So it's really gonna cut back on all your prep time. It's gonna really, and, and the, truthfully, the easiest part is the control time and temperature because you don't have to worry, you don't have to cut your food. There's no guessing. All you have to do is either sear it out or, or broil it in the oven. So, one side note on this is you know, we want to pay close attention to the cooking times and temperature. You can look that up. The chicken and the steak are going to be different times. For this demonstration, we're going to do the chicken at 170 degrees for about two hours. The steak we would do at about 125 for about an hour and 15 or an hour and 20. But you can look those recipes up on the side. For this one, we're going to use the chicken. We're going to take the potatoes and the cauliflower and put that all in and cook that all at once. Okay, let's open our sous vide system here. Let's pop our chicken in. Let's pop our cauliflower and our potatoes. And then this is an optional one. This rack right here, you can actually put it down just so it holds them immersed, okay? All right, the two hour timer's done. Let's open the sous vide system right here, okay? Let's remove this, okay? And I just have a uh, sheet tray with some paper. Let's pull out the potatoes, looking great. Great texture on that, great color. Same with the cauliflower, look at that. Really nice, and last but not least, our chicken. All right, so general rule of thumb, we're gonna let this sit at room temperature. You know, maybe put a paper towel under it until it comes to room temperature before we put it in the refrigerator, okay? A couple days later now, crew, and um, I have all three packets and I'm gonna get ready for dinner. Beat behind me, I have the oven at 450 degrees convection roast. You can do it on your cooktop or in the oven. All we wanna do is get a good sear on it, some caramelization, and heat it all the way through. Easy as this. Let's open up our cauliflower. Right here, beautiful. The chicken, nice and easy as well. And our potatoes. Fits in really nice. We're just gonna go right in the oven, 450, for about six to eight minutes. Woo. All right, look at this. Hold on, let me close this oven door. Check this out, heat it all the way through, roasted to perfection, another couple minutes. Sous vide system, definitely meal preps for a crowd. Perfection.